with another video for, for the, the channel. channel. And guess what we're talking about today? Y'all, we're basically talking about our way to college. Yes, basically, I our journey to lie. college. Basically. Yes, our journey to college. So, we're going to start from... Y'all, we graduated. We graduated. We did four years in, I'm just saying, in college. Four years. <laughs> four years and we're done. We've been telling y'all we're going to give y'all... Um, Tips content and all it is and about college, college but, but we're graduating and it's like we're trying to go into our careers now. But if y'all still want tips on college and everything, let us gotcha. know in the um down there in the comments. We might do it, but I feel like it's kind of old old news now because but we're not no, in college. We're prime. like we just we just recently graduated, so we can give the tips and the do's and the don'ts and stuff. Because we did period. four years and we graduated. And we know what we're talking about, period. And plus, we went to two different schools. HBCU and yeah, I'm not going to say PWI. Roar, roar, roar. But I went to a diverse school. That's what I'm going to say. I looked it up to see if you was a PWI, but it said it Catholic. Say it said Catholic school, but right, are you a PWI or HBCU? You know you're not an though. HBCU, but like. Girl, but it was whites and blacks and Hispanic. It was so many different people. Yeah, they said it's um, so, more of that than... Right, like that. So, so anyways, we're gonna talk about our journey to getting to college. We're gonna start a series up on this YouTube about talking our about our testimony in college. Like it's so and many how God helped us because right. y'all be thinking God not real and God is real. God showed so himself in I college. Did, I'm telling y'all, do bro. <laughs> Well, I can talk about about my scholarships and it's this, so that, and many things, bro. bro. I'm telling y'all, y'all be thinking God not real, but God was working with us throughout college. Both of us, and bro. I'm not just saying. one, but two. exactly. And I feel as though that I do have some testimonies, and A I don't care. Testimonies. Like some of this stuff is like wow. Like every time I tell people my story, they be like, right. And my thing is like when my testimonies were happening. In front of people, like, I'm not telling my business, but when somebody sees something happen to me, because clearly it was in broad daylight or something, then, like, all, the, all of a sudden, something else happened, like, five minutes later or an hour later or whatever, everybody was like, dang, Deanna, like, and then everybody was like, y'all know that's, like, some people that believe in God, that's like, y'all know that's nothing but God and stuff. Like, people was, like, literally witnessing how God was working in situations, bro. Y'all just don't understand. But let's get into it because I want to tell y'all mine, and I don't know yes. if we should do two separate. No, we just going to have to keep it quicker, and it's right. going to be at least be 20 minutes. 30 minutes or 20 minutes. Because I, I have my own something. story from my college, like, literally. Yeah, but we only just talking about, in this video, we're just going to talk about getting to college. So this is senior year of high school, and everybody's talking about. What, I mean, to be honest, college was talked about, but I was clueless through this whole thing. I ain't gonna catch y'all. Like, I just knew I was going to college. I was probably going to community college because I knew I, I was going afford. to a community college. For I knew show. I couldn't afford it, bro. We're exactly. in a low income school. Like, how do you think you're going to? The university? only way you're going to a university is if you have you have scholarships and academically, yes. or um, what is it called academically or um sports right and my thing is yes we, we didn't have high sports. grades we was gonna low-key do volleyball sports but we was not that good in yeah, volleyball we was, like we, we not loved tall, doing volleyball it's not about being tall but we loved them no volleyball. they was no but we was in, in like, college they yes you some of them short, are shorter and but you gotta be really really good and short but i'm saying like we was not really a technical school of volleyball like volleyball yeah, was we like, was losing. it was like fun <laughs> Type yeah, I guess they were just playing for fun, but I wasn't playing for fun. And we didn't really I, have a good coach, so it wasn't like a coach coach. Yes. Like, how people be like, yeah, volleyball, volleyball. No, no it was just, just a volleyball thing. We had volleyball. Like, it's a lot of stuff we had. It was like putting teachers over. You but know, it's not about stuff. that. Yeah, this not. So, yeah, let's okay. get into the video, for real. So, we didn't know we was going to college. At yeah. all, we was just going we to. We wanted a to. Yeah, that was our dream to go to college. Like, we was getting high grads and all of that. But, but our SAT score was not good. I'm not going to even. Not a good test taker. We got a testimony for that SAT score too. I ain't gonna catch to y'all, but that's another video. Um, we thought we was just going to community college, and we was just cool with that because they said after two years of community college. You can go to a university. And we, said, and we okay, had the star scholarship. So that means everything was free. Free bus rides. For two years. Free um, school. It's just the life. Yeah. Yes, because of um, our grades and everything. So we was just okay with that. But yeah. my mom was like, oh, um, we're about to go down to Florida with my sister. We're moving to Florida. I think she was just saying that at the time. Like, when we look back at it, 
Because she heard us saying that. we wanted to go to Florida for school if we would. That's what happened. Oh, I didn't she know. She was going to move I was to just going to go to a community college. I didn't even know what college I was going to go to or not. But, um, so she said, we're moving to Florida, so look for schools in Florida. So all I did was search up schools in Florida, colleges in Florida. And then I seen a few, da, da, da. I didn't really look that hard as I should have done. But then Barry just, Barry University popped out to me. And I don't know nothing about Barry University, but it popped out. And then it said Miami, Florida. I said, ooh, Miami. Miami, then it had a pool. I was so, but then That's I, looked in, I looked up, I started doing research and everything. The campus was beautiful. And everybody was like, now like people would be talking about how the campus, not all that. But when you're coming from Chicago and stuff, that was very beautiful to me. Like I never yeah. seen anything tropical and everything so, like yeah. that to me. So palm trees, right? I never Covers. seen that type of stuff before. So don't do too much, y'all. So then, um, I went to do my research. They said they had sororities. They had the sorority that I wanted. They had a band, y'all. They said they had a band, bro. And what they, type of band? That's the thing. You should have looked That's it up. Thing. That's the thing. I she was thought she was going to get HBCU. You experience, No, bro. you will never get an HBCU. Okay. It's not don't a Don't try H to act like we don't. HBCU. Like you would have known that I'm too. I'm just though. saying. Back I knew my school. Mind y'all, I was a freshman. Okay, I mean, I'm a so I can say what I have so to say. So I was a senior. Don't be trying to act like she would have known. I'm just saying you're not going to get that experience at it. At a place, yeah, that's not an HBC. That's okay, all I'm cool. Saying. We know that now. We graduated, but you yeah. Know that. So they said they had the sorority I wanted, so I was like, cool, like I'm good. Period. Girl, I went to that school. They even had that sorority. They even had that band. They, they even had, had some of the stuff. They, they said they had D nine too, though. On it's the okay. website, they had pictures and everything. <laughs> that was gotcha. the old, gotcha. very like old back in the day. And that stuff not even known now at that school. But that, that's a whole nother story, y'all. That's a whole nother story. But it had to sell me because it was in Miami, Florida. So then I just applied. I was just applying. I think I applied to FAMU or something. I but I don't even know. There. No, I don't know. I applied to another Florida school, but I didn't even know what I was applying to, who I was applying to. Hey, I didn't know how to like, really apply. I could me. agree with you. I did applying. But um, on the fast foot part, like put yeah. it from the top. I didn't know. I didn't. I and didn't apply. I was just on. And another thing is, we was just applying to colleges like all over yeah. the United States. We were getting in. We was getting scholarships and everything. But but it wasn't we enough. We couldn't tell if it was enough or it wasn't. I enough. just didn't want to come out of pocket. Me either. So if, if I have to come out of pocket, I'm not, not going. going. I'm gonna go to community college and try to find someone to get is, We was just applying just to say we got accepted <laughs> into these schools. But when we was going to community college. So to see what schools you can get into, right? right? So I applied to um the Florida schools, then Barry University. Like I didn't really, would, I was just doing it, bro. I was just doing it. Then Barry University come back and somebody they, I it. love Barry. And then somebody um basically one of those teachers or counselors looked over my stuff. They said, "Oh, you're getting a lot of scholarships. You need to go here. You need to go here." Da, 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 That's what happened. Mm -hmm. And. They was like basically saying this is a good choice and stuff and everything. Barry I don't even come know what with they the, was talking about. Barry come with the scholarships for sure. They do. I'm gonna just say that. But they, yeah, I got a, I got my education for free. I just didn't get the dormitory for free, and that's when they get you it. Yeah, that's where they get you. That's where they got me at. That's where they got my butt. But, but you done with your yeah. So okay. that's how I got to Barry. Yeah. So for me, let me tell y'all, I was a real testimony. It wasn't Skip my first hers. choice, though, y'all. That was not my Skip first her choice. Skip hers. Mine was a better testimony. And yes, I'm a brag. Girl, but, um, hers is a sick testimony. <laughs> That's what it really is. No, listen, is. listen, listen, y'all. So this the thing. Okay, did so, tell them why. Like, okay. Okay, tell can I story. talk? Can tell I talk? Your story. Tell so your first story. of all, I was thinking about going to hear her stuff. The only reason I was thinking that about going cool. to hear her stuff. Stop, the only reason I wanted to go to Harris, though, because I knew that was at HBCU and it was close to home. Yes. But then I was like, no, too many CVS kids going to Harris, though, so I don't want to go. Right. So I was That's like, go. I was really going to probably go because we went out there. We all uh, had our no, usernames and everything. Going. I wasn't going because no, that campus because was I went, boring. It was boring, bro. When we, I don't know if it's because um, 
we were just out there in the studio. No, we were out there yet. That's the but they had a chair team. They had Greek. They had. They didn't even have a band. I don't know. It was a small campus. I think it was smaller than Florida Memorial. And Barry. And that's it how was I didn't want to go. Small I school. didn't want to go, but they had some good dormitories. They had some good stuff. Um, but I was like, I was really considering Harris though because I wanted to go to an HBCU. Well, she was so bad. It. So I'm like, yeah, because I was definitely going to an HBCU. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna just go to community college. Cool. Um, Deanna figured out she was going to Barry. Cool. Girl, I was really that was really you knew it was. I ain't gonna cop. I wasn't really trying to like. It was just out in the open. No, like, I didn't know when it got to that time. When it got to that time, it was very, very, very. Because I, I don't know. Be I felt, I felt pressured or something. I don't no, know. But okay, like, anyway, who really will pick? Let me shut up. Yeah, it's my story. So look, so she got she just know in my mind at this time it's like past the part she was like she was like should I go to Barry Shaw or not. This was the time when she was really saying like she was going to bury. No. Yes, it I is. Was clean. No, you was Deanna, please. Because it was getting towards time of decision day. And decision day is May 1st. Okay. Keep in mind this the throughout the month. I no, kinda. this is no Deanna. You was really going I to I didn't bury. know we was going there for real. I just said we I got okay. accepted. She and she and she signed up and everything and she was going to bury. She already got my school. I don't know where I'm going to. So y'all look. This is what happened. So I'm like, mom, we in the bed with my mama. We chilling. Every single day. Every single day. Every time I get home or whatever. What school you going to? What school are you going to? You need to figure out what school you're going to. I said, Mom, I don't know what school I'm going to. I keep telling her, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just gonna go to community college. She still, you need to figure out what school you're going to. I'm like, what do you want from me? So Deanna. I ain't know this girl. I ain't gonna be. I ain't gonna be. So my mama was like, "You need to apply to be." I applied, and yeah, no, I don't want her to come to my school. No, I, was I don't want her. her, and she overdoing it. Anyway, she was crying and everything. No, I wasn't. So then no, I applied I to be right. They gave me a good scholarship. I ain't gonna say too much on that scholarship, but they gave me a scholarship, a good scholarship. Did he have? Um, but yeah, they gave me good scholarship. So then I go in my room because I got one of these days. My mom was like, you need to figure out where you're going to. I got sick and tired, bro. Like I was, I was about to cry and everything. Like I was blue, bro. How so, you mean blue? You wasn't doing no cause work. She was, Cause she was making me mad. Like I already told her like these, like these schools not really giving me money for it. Like they was giving me, like all these schools was giving you scholarships. Mm -hmm. But were they enough scholarships to get you through the entire time? Oh, scholarship, right? Oh, um, not scholarship. So I go in my room. I got this big bag of papers. I don't know if I still got all accepted school letters. Away. All accepted letters and stuff uh, from different schools. And she and you accepted, that. you accepted. This is scholarship. Da, 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 da. I had so I remember school. one day, it was just a big bag. Just uh, papers, open Ooh. papers, not open papers. I'm looking through, just looking through, like, what school I'm going to go to. So, I remember one day, before this day happened, I seen, no, I was at the fair. And it said Florida Memorial University. They said they had been, they had Greek. They had, it's just a small private school or whatever. I said, no, I'm not going because I don't know. They campus was looking lame. I said, why would I even go to that type of school? It looked lame. So, I said, yeah, I'm not going. Even though I signed up and everything, because we signed up for all yeah, the schools there. Up for signed up. Got in mail, said Florida Memorial University. You know what I did? I said, I'm not going. I put that thing in my bag. I remember this. And I just forgot it, though. So I put it in my bag. Now, this is the day when I was looking through the back paper. So then I said, okay, let me just open this up. That thing said, you are awarded a full tuition scholarship. I said, what? I said, what? So the thing said December. I think it was past December. You had like until this time to say to accept the, to accept the scholarship and everything, bro. I passed the date, bro. Hear me out. I passed the date. I know. Hear I told out. my mama. She said, "What? You had this all this time sitting on the scholarship?" Sit, she said, "You're sitting on the whole scholarship and da, 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 full tuition scholarship, not just the scholarship, full tuition scholarship." I said, "Man, it's just a full tuition scholarship, like." I still got to pay for a dormitory. But then she was like, you have financial aid. You um got other scholarships you got um, you're applying to and this, nothing, third. And I was like, oh, yeah, the 
cool. And then you can get more scholarships. So I said, oh, yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. So then I go to school. So keep in mind, we don't really mess with our senior counselor. She wasn't really helpful throughout our senior, um, our throughout whole probably year. our whole semester, our four years. We can have a YouTube video on that lady. She wasn't really what helping. And I didn't go to her about this. That's when my GPA was low because of her. Because she was trying to put she me had in favorites. She had favorites for sure. But, um, yeah, she, um, so I didn't go to her about it. I went to another counselor and his name is Mr. Watson. And basically he was like, I can't believe he was going off on me. And it's like, I couldn't say nothing. Cause it's like some I deserve to get yelled at, even though he wasn't yelling at me. But it was but like it's like, it's like disappointing and like and what he was doing. black too, so you know. And it's like it was on a whole nother level too. Yeah, it was on. A, it wasn't like he trying to get like on me. It was. But it's like, it was he was trying to get on me. But it's like I couldn't say nothing. I knew I was wrong. He was right. Everybody was right. I couldn't get mad. He was like, this is what we was talking about. Y'all need to be looking at everything that come in the mail. This is what we was talking about. And they was talking about that. Mm -hmm. Look at, they don't care if you didn't like it or not. You have to look at it. And I didn't. I was one of those. I didn't think I was one of those, but I was one of those. And so he was like, um, we don't even know if they're going to set them. You need to hurry up and send it in. He helped me send it in. Everything. He called him. Wasn't he calling me? I think so, yeah. And he just was, to get he was, out for her, just to get her in the school. <laughs> he was not playing. He was dude, not playing. My thing is, dude wasn't our counselor, dude. That's yes, he saying. wasn't our counselor. But, but he, he was, made a way. He was over there going in. He was at, at the same time he was going in on me. He was trying to hurry up and get me into that college, and I respect him for that because he was not playing. But um, after that, dude said they get her in. <laughs> he was not playing. He was mad, but he <laughs> <laughs> screaming and yelling, "Why grabbing stuff that he needs?" Trying to hurry up and get me to that college because, like, that's a full tuition scholarship. What did you? We not about to let this go, right? <laughs> so then, um, got an email talking about oh. Um, you get the blue scholarship. You're still like they basically saying I still can get it. I and got stuff. the orange scholarship. Oh, this the testimony, y'all. This is the testimony. So look, they said you get the blue scholarship because of your GPA. They said for you to get a blue scholarship, you have to have a three point nine to something four point or whatever. I don't know a three point nine and up to get the blue scholarship at Florida Memorial University. I had a three point seven, I believe at the time, and they said. Um, you supposed to get an orange scholarship, but that's not what was sent to my email. So something was going on in Florida Memorial Office that was not good. And come to find out, so I'm like some nah. Um, they was like, you are awarded the blue scholarship. You can get the blue scholarship. Then months later, they said, no, you supposed to get the orange scholarship. You have to be awarded the orange. I said, no, that's not what y'all told me. I was, um put my decision in and everything. Yeah, I'm, I'm on my way to Florida, trying to get my blue scholarship. They said, <laughs> okay, okay. So I get there. I get there. They talking about some. Oh, you're supposed to get the orange scholarship. That is half a tuition. I'm not playing with nobody and they mama. My mama was not playing. So look, she was like, no, she's already down here and y'all promised her the blue scholarship. Look, I already knew that they were supposed to give me the orange scholarship off my GPA. But you think I'm going to say something? No, oh, that's your mistake. That's I'm your mistake. Your mistake. Exactly to my thing. And I feel like that was God. And I feel like that was God. So I went down and they was like, oh. Um, well, they let's was see. Trying to get her doing they, was, they was not trying to give me my scholarship or none of that. So then they said, okay. Um, oh, somebody was else on the phone. I think it was somebody from a, um, the CPS on thing that was mm -hmm. like some y'all said that y'all was going to get her the blue scholarship. So please. And they're down there in Florida, traveled all this way from Chicago. And then this was, she said, this is the thing. She was like, if your GPA is a 3.9 when you graduated, you can have the scholarship. I'm like, bro, what? Come to find out they pick, they um, looked at my GPA because the person was like, you got a 3.9 when you graduate. You got 3.9 when you graduate. You I did. said, you know what? You did. I they promise you. Lied. No, they no, 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 no. It out no they stop playing. Because you ain't no. know. How you, oh, no, because I got a 3.8. No, not down to me. I'm sorry, no, because no. I had a 3.8 or something. Because, listen, I, I wasn't paying attention Ooh. to my GPA when I graduated. No, I, I graduated. 3.7 or 3.8. At the end of the day, I, I was remember. top 15, so it didn't matter. And I was top 20, but I could have okay, had top 15 if that lady wasn't playing with me, y'all. No, I was top 15, right? So I'm like, okay, cool. 
So my thing is, I wasn't looking for my GPA because I graduated in top 15. What am I looking at the GPA for? So the um, counselor was like, you graduated with 3.9. And I was like, for real? So then I was like, then that blue scholarship is mine because she said if I graduated with 3.9, I can get that scholarship. And I believe that was God. And I know that was God because come on, come on. I got that blue scholarship and then the scholarships from Cha and from um Jesse Owens. No, that was not no scholarship. Jesse White. Jesse White was um. Oh, no, man. I'm talking about mine. I got a scholarship from Cha and from Xfinity. Yes, yeah, she got her scholarship. She and got I got an iPad that's right here. <laughs> and I still have it. This is four years old, then. Yeah. Or and I had got me some money. Yep, she had like a chunk change. Two thousand. It was just two thousand. It was two thousand. I, I thought it was more than that. Five thousand. It was five thousand. Anyway, it was just a good chunk of change. And me personally, that was God. Yes. And I was like, yep, got that blue scholarship. Whatever they was doing in the office, thank you to whoever. Period. And they, I heard they lost their job too. Yeah. When I got there, they was like, everybody's going from the office. Why every time in Florida they morning, were giving out that free they money. um they taking away people from out the office mm -hmm. every time firing 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 because they over here giving free money out and or they, they not like that. or they doing something but but let's talk about the Trump parties and stuff how we now nah, we're gonna end this video off right here about how we're just gonna say our how we made our college decision that's, that's what's true. the name of it. We're going to go into the next movie, video. We're going to have the same clothes. To be honest, we're going to be in the same clothes for a lot of videos. Because we're going to do like four videos or something. Because it's a lot. And I don't want y'all to be yeah. sitting here forever. So, this is how we um, basically got our, made our decision. Made our decision. Oh, yeah. So, let's talk about decision day before we end it up. Decision day. Y'all, we Girl. looking cute. We had on our leather pants with our t-shirt. Leather pants? We had leather pants? Yes. We had leather pants. Well, our college t-shirt. My mom made us t-shirts because we didn't. So, I didn't able know. To buy it. And then we had our leather jackets with our cute ponytail, blonde ponytail with yes. our edges. But, y'all, listen. I didn't know what college y'all was going to. So, my mama already bought paper and mm -hmm. shirts for um, Deanna already. But then, she when I, I found out like three days before um, decision day where I was going to. And so, she basically gave me gold for she my She gave SMU. both of us gold. Yeah, and, and I had an orange shirt. Some colors is gold, but yeah, I had an orange shirt. Had she had a red shirt, and that's what we wore to the city. Red and orange with the leather. I'm right. I'm going to FMU. We're going to put this up on the screen. And people's like, "Oh, you're going to FMU? Are you going to FMU? Like, clearly you say C F M U. You do not see F A M U. Like, come on now, be for real. But we was there, and it was a little fun experience and stuff. But the only thing was, was our counselor. She, oh, we have. Kids going to different yes. cities. Wait, wait, wait. No, it was more than just us going, going to it different places. More other people just going to different places. A tad bit. A tad bit. She different. Um, and then she, we had two people going to Miami, Miami Florida. But like, this is the thing I want to do say. Nothing. Let me tell you, because since I know that we're I'm not, we're doing another video. But listen, she throughout our entire process, she did not help, help us nothing. one bit, She She kept saying, "Oh, you can't go there. You can't go there." She, I was trying to go to high schools, and she was like, "No, that's no, not no, a real no. school." Da, 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 and I'm not signing off on it. And all yes, that. she just, kept you know, going. So I go like, to an interior interior design school like I wanted to. And all but she was stuff. not going for some of that stuff. And then it's like they CPS had to have um CPS people counselors come to help us. Yes, and that's who helped us. Yes, um, Chicago came through, baby. We yes. don't talk about that. And, and it was another man, I forgot his name, who was at our school, not the CPS. He was helping me too, Mr. Um. Mm -hmm. Dang, I forgot his name. It started with an N. Well, Nelson. You talk about the Mr. white Nelson? man? Yeah. He was nice. He helped me too. But like, the he always helping through whole life. School. Yeah, I ain't gonna like, do he count? No, just clean. He wasn't my counselor, but he, he was always I helping. was hoping he was gonna be my counselor. Yes. And like, I was thirsty for that dude to be my counselor. But nope. And so anyway, her but she didn't try to help nothing. And then everybody, when we all figured out, oh, the thing is, this is how I also know it's got that Barry, right? And then I figured that I was going to SMU, right? Because I was looking for schools and um no, I wasn't. I found the paper in my bag and it said FMU. And come to find out, 
Them schools was 15, 15 minutes, minutes apart. apart. Y'all, so we didn't find like, out they was 15 minutes apart until we got down there. No, I knew. No. Because so how you know? Because, listen, this is why I also chose Florida Memorial. Because when I looked at Florida Memorial apart. and I knew it was in Florida and it said Miami Gardens, I said, let me look. And we but found out. But we didn't out. know that they was 15 minutes apart. We just knew they was in the same city. I guess. I don't know. But anyway, them was 15 minutes apart. That's how so I also knew it was God. Because how we both get into schools that's like, you know. Right there by you. And time. I wanted to go to an HBCU and that was an HBCU. And she went to her school and we was 15 minutes apart. So anyway, we was at the thing and like some of them kids was jealous. I don't care. They was jealous because um, they, they was like. We had, so and they didn't care. do it. So, oh well. And my thing is, it was like, oh, the twins going to Miami, the twins going to Miami, or whatever. Yeah, they gonna be doing this. They gonna no, be doing so that. look, so some of their moms was like, saying, uh, uh. Y'all better um, not be partying and all that. No, but they was just saying it to just tell us, like, and stuff. you know, basically to stay focused. Like, yes, that's like, Miami. don't go to Miami and just party, party, party. Y'all need to stay focused and do this and do that. Everybody telling us, bro. Soon yeah, they heard soon they heard the twins going to Miami. Was, was how the, how on the that. twins? How, first of all, how they know the twins was going? Ooh, ooh, my bad. Not the iPad. Girl. How they know that the twins was going to Miami? Because she they, posted it up. She was posting everybody's schools up. No, before she the did. oh, okay, okay, she you was. Right, you're right. But after that, everybody y'all need to be careful. Da, 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 da. And nobody was going to Miami but the twins in that whole school. And I know people was jealous because they, they know we it was had a party city. No, because they know we had scholarships. Yeah, we that's why I for free. Exactly, they knew I mean, we didn't have no money to be going to no school. So you knew that we were getting some type of money from the schools out in Florida. And everybody, mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. And her, but and, and then the um our counselor, she was like, uh, we got two girls who's going to Miami and da, 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 without your help twins. though. Twins. We got twins going to Miami. Like, First of all, boys. like she happy, like she did something. You ain't do nothing, boo. I want the punch that you ain't do nothing. Face. They uh, did just, something. They did something. Right? They Not need you. to be up talking about how they got us to Miami because they did their job. Exactly. She re oh, because she was our counselor. She wasn't trying to make it seem like she got us there. She wouldn't give us, get us there. Nothing, but we gonna and talk then about our principal was happy. Yes. But <laughs> Taking pictures with us and stuff. On the he was happy, but my thing is. He had to take pictures with us. He was happy the twins was leaving. On the cliff. <laughs> Cause we was we had a storm up in that school. We was a storm for real. But my thing it is, wasn't because of us. People kept messing with us. But we and then we talk kept trying this. to get stuff together to be um make stuff right. But them, make the them, school better. And everything. That school was out of control. But my thing is, she was just up there happy like she did something. And then when we came back to CVS, like after we graduated, she went hey, do, do, do. we me and the other like, like we don't we like you know we don't mess with us right. You was trying to get us not first of all. She only started helping when everybody like, was on us, on us trying to help us. That's when she was trying to put her little two, two cents in. in. Like, girl, you're not even. We're like, not talking about she that was in coming another to the video. meeting and trying to add two cents. Yeah, like, like girl, girl move. Meeting. You didn't want me to go you're to college. You ain't want me to go to college, but I made it. <laughs> you're sick. But I made it. But, uh, but that's gonna be the story too. Like, girl, you ain't want me to go to college, but I made it. You're sick. But I made it. But that's gonna be the story for like how we, um, how our decisions came to be. And the next one's gonna be how, how we got to college, bro. How we got there. And that's what we talked about before. But like, share, share and subscribe. And always tell your kind of hot. And don't, don't let it fall. Be me, majestic, majestic eminence. Turn on post notifications up. Period. Peace.